What an opening. Yeah. Tar pits. Animals. What is this? Now with real tar. That's real tar. So the third clue takes us to the tar pits. Gray. Let's see. Everything is underneath the tar, so let's dive in head first. These are my best shoes, Phelps. I'll leave you to it. <clears throat> ah, great. You're gonna let me do this again, Rust? Oh, you're, you're such a good That's friend, funny. Finbar. Yeah, great. I think there might be a walkway under the tar. You see those posts? So look at the posts, and maybe then you can sort of graft an idea as to where the tar is. But if you look closely, you can just see the walkway right there, making this an absolute oh. non-challenge. What happens if you go into the tar? You know, probably you drown. Instant death. Probably, yeah. I mean, an elephant can't get out of this shit. You think I can? Look, a live saber-toothed tiger tried to go in the tar pits, and he couldn't make it out either. And now well, he's are... now he's been preserved pristinely for th you know, yeah. tens of thousands of years above that... above the tar. That's what I'm wondering. It's like, how do they look so preserved when they rotted away? I'm pretty sure they're fake, and they're just put in there for effect because you know it's like tar pits where animals died a whole bunch of time ago. Yes. Eesh. Because I don't know what kind of sick kicks you can get from watching a saber-toothed tiger trying to f desperately get out of the sticky black gunk that has doomed it to death. Doom. Doom. It's like, look, Mommy! He'll never see his wife or kids again! <laughs> look at that. The missing white shoe from the white shoe slang. And another goddamn clue. Uh, this is the f Okay, this is the fifth clue. See, this is what I'm talking about. If a slight breeze blows past this letter, it goes straight into the tar, never to be seen again. I bet he's watching nearby. It's like the fifth note I've had to put in. Shit! Oh, there's a crossover. Maybe he uses that thick cardstock so it doesn't blow away as easy. Open white you know, if you, if you really want to piss Rusty off, if he says something out of line, you just take your shoe and <laughs> right on his fancy pants. <laughs> just splat. Call! And then the theme music plays. da 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 Call it Rusty on the way to solving crimes every day. <laughs> it didn't. Uh, the series didn't last long because they tried to do you know wacky hijinks with really horrendous live action murder scenes. <laughs> it, it, it was a really inconsistent tone and it did, didn't didn't go out with the younger audience. Uh, <laughs> Cole holds up a body. Hey, Rusty, look at this. <laughs> so next clue is the L.A. County Art Museum, which is right up the hill. No, oh, this that's guy convenient. Looks out for women in bars who've had too much to drink, who are emotionally disturbed, need a shoulder to cry on. He All right, booze. Still, driving oh, still driving safe. Still driving safe. We had, we had a little bit of a mess up earlier. We went a little crazy, but still driving safe. I'm going to take out all of my aggression, all my impatience on this bouquet of flowers. Okay. All right, I'm sated. Hey, uh. So I've come up with a, uh, a theory of mine. What do you got? Jesus, I think... I think Rusty is the Origami Dahlia killer. You're fucking wrong. If you think it's gonna go that way, give the game a little bit more credit than that. Is it somebody we know? Let me ask you that. No, uh, yes. It is somebody we know? Yes. Chief of Police? <laughs> no. 
Okay. Uh, it's it's somebody we have seen, but not somebody we know. Somebody we've seen, but somebody, but not somebody we know. Yeah. Like okay. it's it's not a cop. I'll tell you that much. It's not a cop. Okay, because my next guess was going to be Phelps in the complete <laughs> hacks guide to writing <laughs> mysteries. Again, um, th- this isn't this isn't <laughs> David Cage. Okay. David Cage. Uh, uh, let me think. Uh. Uh, maybe it's Queen Elizabeth II. <laughs> we'll figure it out. She's, she's, secret, she's like, secretly committing murders. She would have been like 18 at the time. It's, wait, hold on. Goddamn monarchy sending hitmen over here. How old would she have been? Thank you. It's Asian 47. The center of the proverbial labyrinth? No, she sent oh. James Bond. How many unsolved murders have we got? No... Actually, it's uh, David Bowie, this is the Goblin King, because we're about to go through a labyrinth. You ever been oh, in here? are we gonna find the baby? We're oh, gonna find the baby there. in the center of the maze. Just be careful of David Bowie's very and presenting package. It can li- knock a person's eye out. I don't like that movie. I don't really like <laughs> Labyrinth. <laughs> I didn't like it either. So, this is a very difficult hedge maze, but hey, don't you want to do it, Rusty? Help me out. Don't you want to do it, Rusty? Come on! No way! I had to climb something. I had to go through tar. You can do this, fat boy. Come on! You can even have a drink in the hedge maze. I won't tell the chief. Fine. <laughs> Fuck you! Do everything myself, and I'll get full commendations, and I'll get the promotion, and you can go sit there with your thumb up your ass! Oh, God. The way you said that reminded me of, <laughs> for some reason, of Mel Black. Come on, fat boy! <laughs> Come on, fat boy! <laughs> Stand up here, son! Come on! <laughs> hey, Bubba! <laughs> uh. Old fashioned cartoons are great. Anyway, there's the end. Oh, hey! How'd you do that? Oh, Easy. yeah, that's right, you're cheating. No, I'm just that good. I'm a master of. Any. Thrones, altars, blob, fucking, oh, what is this The shit? ghosts! Every time I imagine a world oh, where I ghosts. can find the truth. See, I'd like to think the ultimate punchline is that the killer is actually lost in this maze right now. <laughs> like, they put, they found the middle and they were like, oh, sweet, I could put the next clue here. And now they're just stuck here. He was at a dead end. I didn't run into any, so I couldn't catch him. We got Celine Henry's ring. We're going, pa- we're going through all of the fucking murders that we've solved and finding a missing piece of evidence from each one of them. Well, oh, and it's gotten dark. It is getting dark. This is taking all day. Ooh, and you know what? Ooh, you know what? I think we might run into a murder at the next spot. Makes you oh, think we're gonna, mm. oh, we're gonna run into an, an attempted murder, I should say. And tackle the guy. Keep your intrigue high, detective. This case isn't over yet. <laughs> but I tell you, it's gonna be one hell of a climax you're not gonna see coming. Because we're gonna accidentally run him over in our rage. We already killed him. Shit. Uh, oh. He was one of the people we ran over. Alright. No! Next place. Uh, let's see. It, da, da, it's a hidden vehicle. Da, 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 it's not it. No. Um, hmm. Another hidden vehicle. Uh, these, these are all hidden oh, vehicles. Oh, it's one of the bartenders at the bar. Hmm. Nah, that's too obvious. Because uh, bartenders are great people. The intolerance set. Yes. Vanity. He wants to see if there's anyone out there smart so, Somehow that poem matches up to it, but Cole Phelps is so smart that he can... He, he uh, studied literature when he was in high school, and so he can smell bullshit nonsense a mile away. He can just cut through all pretense and know exactly what uh, any hack poet is talking about. Hmm. So it's like, Rid me this, Batman! What has newspaper? It- oh. I wonder... Does he know Twin Senpao? <laughs> he was Twin Senpao! He went to school in Japan! Oh! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, 
Oh, that means he knows Nobuo. <laughs> yeah, uh, his uh, marriage with his wife is just a sham, but really he has that for Nobuo-kun. God, Nobuo's ageless. <laughs> Maybe. And then L.A. Noir starts glitching. Well, maybe it could be Twin Senpai's dad. Oh, okay. I could see that. <laughs> Motherfucking Doki Doki Literature Club. Motherfuckers. L.A. LA Literature Club. And Rusty's like, You're not getting me to read no frou-frou books, okay? <laughs> books is a woman's job. <laughs> God, that just reminds me of God of War more. Oh, reading is a job for a boy. <laughs> I don't need to read things. I would love it if we just had his old voice doing most of the shit. It would make so, it would be so I, awesome. I would love it so much. Boy, you will read this. You will oh, yeah. make its knowledge known to me. He tries to read a single sentence, but it's giving him like a conniption fit. So he goes. Aah! Think about it. It'd be, it'd be so much better. In art, and he'd be like, you know, it says open with the louder. It says like you mean it. It <laughs> says that you need the key of Genipsis in order to open the door. Hey, come on. Ooh. Oh, we successfully broke into the set. Way to go, boy. Wait. There's the throne up there. Is the killer... The guy we saved from the Mafia? Or did he die? Am I, th am I thinking wrong? He was taken away. He was taken away, okay. So that's a no. So once again, Cole Phelps has to find the clue again. Yet again. Yet a fucking again. Or else he's just gonna uh... sit in his ass and drink from his three flasks I know he has. Because I've seen him pull out the same flask from three different pockets. I'm just thinking, is there an LA equivalent to, like, 40s redneck? Because I have a feeling Rusty has a flask for his flask. Well, they use the word oaky. Jesus, now look what you did. Uh oh. On, Paul, get you oh, well. Okay. I, I know what the. What the hell? What? Why didn't what? you? Why didn't you jump? That looked perfect! You could've- I know what you were doing! You could've jumped it! You could've made it! What the hell? Okay, huh. let's- let's try that again. No, that looks spot on! I don't know why you didn't Jesus, jump! Did. Alright, so it wants me to keep it in balance. Why? Because Rusty oh, is- until Ru Rusty's okay. gonna go out here. I guess we couldn't have made that jump. So Rusty goes out and gets a plank here. He's working on something. He's work a little, little, little faster he's, there, he's but there you go. On it. All right, so he puts that, that out there, and so now we got to do what we were trying to do. So then we jump, and if you look closely, we we could have made it without that shit. Yeah. What a crock of shit! Nope, I, you need my help, Phelps. Boy, that that type of thing just pisses me right off. That is the sort of thing I have in. Intolerance for. <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> for the people currently typing in the comment section, uh, cricket, 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 cricket. <laughs> oh, there we go. I thought that was a chair. <laughs> it's a ladder that leads down to the throne. A ladder. Then here we have. Oh, we just get one letter and it says, Look behind you. A typewriter <laughs> ring. ring. Evelyn Summers. Evelyn Summers. And now we're all caught up. Look behind you, Phelps. Permit ah. the English of that light to blah, 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 blah. Oh, horrible that anyone else speak it. This is the final clue. Okay. It's the last clue. Oh, 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 Jesus. Shit. Fuck. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. Oh, no, man. No, 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 no. He had a tripwire attached to the ring, and now everything is collapsing. I mean, that's the oh, only explanation no. I have. Oh, no. Makes sense. 
Uh, he was planning on trapping you here. If you escape here, you live. And just like at the box office, intolerance fell apart. Oh, we didn't even get to see it. It just got okay. Well, I thought you were about to say it was a box office smash. The last trophy was her ring. Find another piece of the poem. Yes. So now it's time to go confront the killer. Let's find out. We've been following the clues that have led us up to this. All right. Where is it, though? It's very obvious where it is. There it is. All right, let's go. What? 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 The church, because really? it's always the church. Breathe, breathe, damn it. Oh, the killer is the guy from the morgue. Of course. I'm not trying to justify it. You want to know what's you want to know what's really funny? What? In all of your random guessing, you got it right. Ah oh, shit! Uh, one of them you got right. Okay, so it wasn't. That's the nobody from the police force. That's the only hint I'm gonna give you now. It you, wasn't. You accidentally guessed correctly. Oh, that was one of the bartenders. Da, da. I guess this was supposed to be a recreation of gothic Christian 16th century stuff or whatever. It's either that or the beginning of Night of the Living Dead. And the beginning of Bloodborne, I'd say. Do you come seeking the blood? The blood of the truth! Kick open the door, but... Oh. Uh, well, it doesn't open that way. <laughs> Try to kick it open and you accidentally hurt yourself. But, ah! the pull door reminds me of my days as an altar there's a light coming the in priest the touch me nothing hasty gentlemen keep your hands where I can see them or I'll be forced to redecorate the stucco with your entrails we're from the LAPD sir I'm gonna tell you only once to lower your weapon. The LAPD, you say? You're right, it was one of the Is bartenders. Really Yay! How interesting. Put down the gun, shitbird. Last warning. This boorish ignoramus could never have found me. It was you, wasn't it? Oh, he's got a higher vocabulary. Actually, Ooh, uh, He likes poetry. Actually, technically speaking, uh, it was yes. thanks to Eurogamer that I, uh, <laughs> that I uh, found you, you so... They're the ones that did all the work, so, uh, thanks to all the boys over across the ocean we'll in, in London that. for helping me with your own game. Wherever your gamer is. I don't even remember this guy. I gotta tell you, though, I, I really appreciate, uh, this part of their guide, because for everything that they, that, uh, when you're interviewing someone, they, they always say, accuse, or lie in the original version, or good cop, or truth in the original version. Go? It's always like that. So, uh, if you want to take this guy out, you have to accuse or lie in the original version in wait in hiding. It's re re really appreciated. I have a strange feeling that's sarcasm. And no, and no matter what, we have to do what we must to find the good cop or truth in the original version. It's all right. We have infinite ammo. I just remembered. So die, die, die! Yes, I'm gonna find this bastard. He's not gonna hurt any more women. And I'm gonna shoot, shoot up out every candle. And if he gets away, I'm gonna shoot up all his shit so that way you can't resell it. And all of his nice things are going away. Like your bed. Nope, can't sleep with that anymore because now it smells like gunpowder. Nice shirt. It's covered in holes. Chair. Dresser. All this <laughs> shit. It's going out. <laughs> So I just thought of something. What if all of his, like, what if all of his dressers, what if every, like, behind every door, what if stuffed in every mattress was another body he was planning to plant? And you just shot a bunch of people. I have probable cause. I'm good. <laughs> I was chasing the bad guy. What do you want? Oh, uh, he went down underground. I wasted a lot of time shooting. He's probably long gone by now. Fuck. And oh, that's probably where he killed all the bodies. Whoa, let's go back up. I heard a clue sound. What's all this? Oh, it's still the bodies. Oh, kill the bodies. Man. Kill the bodies. Oh, boy, okay. Medical experience. At least some working knowledge of biology. These cruel 
We could, we could pin all the murders on him. This looks so bad. If we could bring him in alive, there's enough physical evidence for an airtight case. So we we found the guy. This is the guy who probably did all the murders. What are the chances of all of you alive? But what about the people that we brought in? That's what I want to know. Didn't they do it too? Hmm. Ah! Hey, 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 I got, got slippers oh, on. I got shit in the back. I, the blood's on the water. I can smell you now. Where you at? Where you at? Come on. Come around. I got you. Come here. Yeah, I am acquainted with slaughter. It, uh, it's very nice. I like it when they look me in the eyes and the uh, life just. Uh, where the fuck did he go? <laughs> I had a monologue. Get back here. Anyway, I like it when the life drains from their eyes and they look at me and they just cough up blood one last time. Anyway, what's gonna happen to you once I find you? Where you at? Yeah. I already did a hedge maze. I'm prepared for this. Thanks for training me for this, so I could kill you easier. Uh, maybe you have the makings of a serial killer, Detective Cole Phelps. Have you ever thought of that? Nah, he's a cream of wheat kind of guy. Kind of guy. Oh, you killed him! Yeah, he's dead. Why? Cause it was fun. Where's the press, Gap? I think Phelps and I should get a medal for this. This has got to be the case of the year, right? The case of the century, when you think about it. Are you finished? Yes, Skipper. Good. Because there won't be any press briefings. So, um... Or commendations. I want you to do something for me, dude. About? Yeah. Uh, you, you see that rug on the floor? The killed the Dahlia, killed mm -hmm. all I want the you to lift it up, okay? God, no one. Okay. I want you to take this broom. Was a ghost. Can you at least yeah. tell and I want you to take this case. And using that broom, put it underneath the rug, would you? Could you? Could you? Sure. Thanks. Beyond the moon for mere mortals like us, Rusty. There'll be no more mention of it. So we just solved the serial case, but nobody is ever going to talk about this again. I won't be a part of that. A bit of missing evidence at the grand jury. A procedural error here. Except for that, maybe that hobo guy. He definitely killed somebody. I'm afraid it is. These are people who still deserve to be in jail, most of them. No more rooting around in the entrails of cadavers. But hey, there is some good news. The head of vice has asked the chief for you. We're being promoted. Yeah. We're gonna get promoted. We're gonna get promoted. We're gonna get promoted. Uh, well, great. So the guy we killed is the brother of a higher up. We can't let anybody know that, otherwise we get shit canned. Hey, look at that! Woo! But hey, at least you got a five-star case closed. It's because I drove safely and I was careful and I was a good little cop and I did my job. Time to throw it all away next time on L.A. Noir. But before that, a military flashback. Oh, this reminds me of the time I got promoted. Breathe out, kid. You'll go purple. I'm scared, Sarge. Everybody's scared, kid. Anyone who says he isn't is a damn liar. You're lying! How many times have you been in combat, Sarge? I was with Raider Battalion on Peleliu my first time. Was it bad? It's always bad. Will this be bad? As bad as it it's gets. It's always it's bad. It's always bad. But, you stick but is this going to be bad, too? To or could this be the one time it's not you. bad? So, guys. Guys. Friendly, Sarge. It's They've always bad. In the last couple of days, kid. I think if they don't get to know you, that they won't have to grieve for you if you get killed. They're wrong. It doesn't work that way. Don't worry. No Marine in this company will let you down. Except Gomer Pyle, he probably will. 